Good morning, MHS. I'm Hannah. And I'm Emily. Today is Friday, November 14th, a day one. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Attention seniors, order your super groovy Senior Week shirts now. They are just $15. Quantities are limited, so reserve your size now. This year, the MHS Drama Club will be performing a cabaret on January 9th, 2015. If you are interested, pick up a form at the chorus room. It must be turned in to Mr. Schuler by the end of the day Friday. All students attending Harvard Model UN should meet in the Red Lab next Tuesday after school for a research meeting that should last until 3.30. Make sure to attend the Foreign Language Volleyball Tournament the Tuesday of Spirit Week. Whether as a spectator or a player, contact your language club advisor for more details. On Tuesday, November 18th, from 5 to 10, Grad Night will be hosting its first official kickoff for Grad Night at Mexico Lindo Restaurant, Main Street, Melrose. Grad Night will receive 15% of all takeout and dine-in orders that evening during the specific times listed above. The Animal Rights Fun Fact of the Day. NBC News' Ian Williams was able to get an up-close look at the panda trio as they celebrated the early milestone. More facts about the triplets. They love to nap. Like any panda, young or old, the cubs love taking a nice nap after eating. They are still waiting to be named. A worldwide competition open to the public to name the pandas, two boys and a girl, has already received more than a million entries. Don't forget to join the math club, room 231 after school every Tuesday from 2.15 to 3. Be there or be square. And now, the French fact of the day. Paul Van Haver, better known by his stage name Strome, is a Belgian singer-songwriter who is very popular in both France and all of Europe. His stage name comes from changing the syllables of maestro around. He describes his music as a mix of hip-hop, dance music, salsa, and French folk music. While his songs are catchy, he addresses serious subject matters such as world health issues, relationships, and family dynamics. President Obama even owns one of his albums. So that's the end of National French Week. Merci et ciao. In sports, our football team defeated Woburn 20-19 during the Division III Northwest semifinal game held at Woburn Friday night. Our team will go against Concord Carlisle Friday, November 14th for the Division III Northwest final matchup. Kickoff is at 6 o'clock. Ticket prices are $10 for adults and $7 for students and senior citizens. Tickets are on sale until 12.30 today. Come and support our team! Our boys cross country team placed third this past weekend at the Eastern State Championships and our girls placed 14th. The boys' team will compete this Saturday at the MIAA State Championships. The girls' swim team competed in the sectional championships this past weekend. Two new school records were established in the 200 medley relay, composed of Madeline Hughes, Virginia Guanchi, Anna Steele, and Samantha D'Alessandro. Also, the 400 freestyle relay, composed of Holly Cohen, Madeline Hughes, Anna Steele, and Samantha D'Alessandro, broke the current high school record. Other medal recipients were Samantha D'Alessandro, who plays second in the 50-yard freestyle and seventh in the 100-yard freestyle. Anna Steele captured seventh place in the 100-yard butterfly. Members of the team will compete in the state championships this coming weekend. New in theaters this week, Dumb and Dumber 2 and The Fox Catcher. Last week's top films still in theaters are Big Hero 6, Interstellar, and Gone Girl. Hello? I'm doing the announcements. Yes, I'll say it. <laughs> Tryouts for hockey cheering are Monday to Wednesday after school in the cafeteria. Please see Allison Callahan, Julia McKenzie, or Leah Tessinari, or Miss Fogarty if you have any questions. For everyone here in the studio, I'm Hannah Giordo. And I'm Emily McCarthy. You have a great day, MHS.